Khloe Kardashian has learned to shrug off the haters over the years. But the new mom certainly wasn't laughing on Friday, when a fan on Twitter called her 12-week-old daughter true, not cute at all. In a series of tweets, Kardashian clapped back at the hater for criticizing her daughter, whom she shares with boyfriend Tristan Thompson. What self-respecting adult would even comment on a child's appearance? What type of disgusting human being are you, the good American mogul, 34, asked. It's pathetic that you are this miserable in your life. She's a loser for that. Kardashian later wrote about the critic. No respect for people like that. People are entitled to their own opinions and feelings but why on earth would you tweet that and if you must why would you tag me? Want all the latest pregnancy and birth announcements plus celebrity mom blogs? Click here to get those and more in the People Babies newsletter. Related, 11 times the Kardashians gloriously clapped back at mom shamers Kardashians hater quickly deleted her tweet, protecting her tweets and writing, I honestly didn't mean for my tweet to get as many replies and whatnot to it. I apologize for my actions and I shouldn't have said what I said. I wasn't thinking at all. But the Keeping Up With The Kardashian stars fans kept standing up for true, sending Kardashian messages of love. I just don't get why people have that much energy to actually project all of this negativity, the reality star told one supporter later. That takes a lot more energy than just being kind. This, of course, isn't the first time Kardashian has defended herself against online trolls. Mommy shaming is real, she told one fan in June who praised her for being open about the fact that she's feeding her daughter formula in addition to breastfeeding. The Revenge Body Hosts workouts, which began again five weeks after welcoming True, also became the subject of criticism. What I'm annoyed about is that I've read a couple of times on Twitter that, you know, they feel that I'm focusing too much on my body, but the truth is, I've worked out five or six days a week before I got pregnant and that's my sanctuary and something I love to do, she said in a Snapchat video in May. So I want to start doing that now and getting into my rhythm and in between feedings I want to find time to work out because that's going to be my new normal, she continued. Just because I have a baby, doesn't mean I have to stop doing the things that I love, and I love working out and getting my mind right. Meanwhile, Friday marked Kardashian's first day back at work since having True. I'm very grateful because Tristan is being a great daddy and he has done all the feedings while I've been gone. Kardashian said on Snapchat, as she hit up the Good American offices. Shout out to all the good dads out there, the mother of one said about the Cleveland Cavaliers power forward, who is also dad to 18-month-old son Prince from his previous relationship with Jordan Craig. As hard as it was for Kardashian, she said she was eager to get back to work. I have a new push and motivation, she said. It's not just for me anymore. Related video, Khloe Kardashian admits she's very anxious about leaving baby True to return to work. Kardashian and Thompson welcomed their first child together on April 16, just days after reports of him cheating on Kardashian while she was pregnant surfaced. Since news of the cheating scandal broke, Kardashian has chosen to stay together with the NBA star. Tristan is spending time with her family, a KUWTK source told People, adding that the Karjiners have jokingly been giving him a bit of a hard time. We are watching you, but otherwise, everyone is being respectful and focusing on catching up with Chloe, the insider continued. She is so happy being a mom. Everyone just wants her to stay in this happy bubble for as long as possible.